wake up classes in session hey y'all today i'm so excited because we are going to be doing our digital vision board yes back in the day it was fun to do the paper vision board and honestly if i had the time um to actually go through and collect pictures print pictures out i would still be interested in doing so but more on a time crunch um, situation I really don't have time to do that so the digital vision board works best for me and please do whatever works best for you so today I'm gonna be going through with you how I put my vision board together digital of course and we are going to be using polish and we are going to be using CapCut so if you don't have those two apps go ahead pause this video and go ahead and download them that way you can actually you know get started with your vision board today is january the second and we are in the new year so happy new year boo new me new you if you understand what i'm saying so go ahead and get yourself a notebook a pen and of course y'all something warm to drink I got my coffee with my cinnamon creamer. Love, love, love cinnamon. And let's go ahead and get straight into it, okay? So, what you're first going to do is you're going to, in your notebook, you're going to write down several different categories. You can tailor this to your own goals. I'm going to go ahead and share a few of the uh, sections that I have on my notebook, okay? So I have faith, family, faith, family, finances, marriage. I have uh, social media, I have education, I have self-care, and that's pretty much all I have on my sections, okay? So you're going to write down those sections and when you write them down, you're going to leave space in between so that you can write down what exactly are you trying to achieve under that section. Like for instance, I'll share my number one with you because my number one goal is the most important of them all. So my faith, uh, my goal is to grow closer to God, okay? So you're going to write what your goal is, but not only are you going to write what your goal is, you are going to write down how are you going to get there? What steps need to be taken to actually get you to achieve that goal, okay? So for example, I'll give you an example on my number one, growing closer with God. So how can I grow closer with God, right? making sure that i am starting my day off reading my bible daily not every other day not only when i feel like it not when i'm in a good mood not when he's only doing something good for me every day reading my bible okay that's gonna help me grow closer to god well i know you're probably thinking well how would that help you grow closer because the more that you're in the word the more the Holy Spirit takes control of you on the inside and has you change things about your life to align with Jesus' purpose, okay, and God's purpose for our, our life, okay? So you're writing the steps that are going to help you achieve the goal. You are going to do that for each section. Let's say if there's a section that I didn't list, you can list anything any section within your life that i did not list that you have a goal that you are wanting to better yourself at put that on here everyone's vision board does not need to look the same what my goals are for me don't tailor to you don't tailor to the girl next door we are making sure that we are doing this vision board off of ourselves and what we're wanting for ourselves to grow into better women okay so you're writing your sections, you're writing what that section means for you, what your goal is, and how are you going to get to that goal? How are you achieving that goal, okay? Once you go through and you do all of that, your next step, all right, let me go ahead and just get a little sip, 
y'all this cup is so cute too it says i'm a hustler baby i just wanted you to know y'all look at that so cute and it has little money signs on the inside y'all because i'm a hustler for myself growth okay i'm just trying to be better every year every day every second okay so your next step is what you're going to do you are going to go ahead and go on google first you need to think of the color scheme the color scheme that you want your vision board to be for me my favorite color is pink hence hence the robe okay the scrunchie and my favorite color is pink so pink that's the aesthetic that i went for so you are going to look up screenshots for each section that you wrote in your book all the goals that you want to make you're looking for a picture that resonates with the goal that you set so a picture that when you look at it your goal comes to mind no words even need to be spoken you look at the picture it gives you a warm feeling and you already know exactly what you're needing to do so for instance for my number one is faith growing closer with god a, sc a screenshot that i took is i looked up uh women reading their bible pink aesthetic okay so and i and i looked at what popped up now sometimes it doesn't always align sometimes google throws off some google siri whatever you know sometimes what you're looking for may not come up but you might find something else that can still go along with what your what your vision is so you're going to take a screenshot of whatever picture for each one of your categories okay so if you have five categories you're taking five screenshots okay six categories six screenshots okay and you're gonna go ahead and make sure that you crop your picture so you do your screenshot you make sure you go in and you crop all of your pictures so that the, it is it's easy once we start getting into the app and start applying okay so you do your screenshot you crop your picture you also need to do a screenshot of whatever background theme that you want so for me i wanted a pink background because you need a surface that you are going to lay everything on so you're you're thinking the way the the way that we're doing this digital vision board is we are going to save it to the screensaver of our phone okay so it needs to be vertical a vertical background and then basically you are going to overlay your photos on your on on the background okay so i got one that says make it happen i believe it says make it happen yeah make it happen okay so it has make it happen in the middle and it's a pink background and i pretty much displayed all my pictures around i will go ahead and show you mine just to kind of give you an idea and hopefully you find some inspiration from the one that i made so go ahead get all your screenshots together next what i'm going to be showing you on this video and i haven't quite decided if i'm gonna do a like voiceover or if i'm just gonna play music because pretty much it's self-explanatory what we're getting ready to do is we're getting ready to go into the we're going to go ahead and go into the CapCut app and we're going to go ahead and add everything and do our layover and everything and I'm going to show you. So we're going to go into CapCut, get everything all laid out, okay? Once we get everything on CapCut together, we're going to go ahead and save that, okay? Save that image. You're going to have to do like a screenshot, crop it, save the image. Then you're going to have to take that over to polish and you're going to have to fit it to a size that fits your screen to your phone so that you can save it as your screensaver. So y'all, wake up. Class is in session.
it through the digital vision board course 2024 with your girl Tajma on time for tea because you know I'm giving you that tea so that you can be a better you and I can be a better me we got this remember girl you are beautiful you are valued Jesus loves you and we got this let's make sure we're taking care of our mental health keeping the word of God for on the forefront everything else will follow everything that our heart desires will follow okay until the next video make sure you like okay you can comment and subscribe because that's the only way that your girl is going to grow okay so go ahead support your girl join the family i would love to have you here let's build a community of women that you know we're able to share advice help each other out and if you have a different way of doing this vision board or if you maybe are a person who have done a paper vision board or if you have any tips for anyone please drop them in the comments i would love to hear them love to hear your thoughts your comments until next time bye